up, YouTube? Hey, what's up, YouTube? What's cracking? What's up, fam? Hey, How are you so guys? what's up, man? It's been a long time since we made Way a YouTube video, but um, doesn't matter because we're here right now and we have a dope, 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 amazing um youtube video right here that's about to go down i'm excited for this game guys. so this game right here is a it's a card game a bunch of different questions so we did a TikTok video and a lot of people were asking us that we should do a longer um lengthier video um so we decided that we should do a youtube video since we um, haven't been on here for so long so i right. think this is great content yeah yeah and it's fun well. man it's fun we got that our that's actually yours we got some you know so the answers are going to be more honest than genuine um the questions here are crazy bro they're raw and uncut yeah dude. they're raw and uncut and um <laughs> Unless you have a strong relationship with your significant other, I don't recommend you playing it. Simple as that, right? Yep. Yep. Okay. So you yep. want to? You want to? So what we're gonna do is. This is question. You gotta shuffle these because you just looked at them and I, I, no, I feel didn't. like you just placed no, them. No, I didn't. Yeah, this, you did. Yeah, it's you just did. a bunch of random relationship questions, and. Um, so we're just, we're not going to pick up the top. We're going to pick randomly in the deck, right. okay? I'm cool with that. I'm cool so with that. You got to be honest, bro. I'm going first. Okay, so you, when you... Oh, this question we already asked earlier, so... That's fine. Recording. It's not recorded? I don't Is it a good to. one? I don't like it. <laughs> Who do you still think no. about from your past? Stop! Uh, let me no. ask that question to you. Who do you think about your past? Since you don't like it because you don't want to ask me that question, who do you think about I in your past? I want this one instead. Yeah, but I'm asking you this question. I'm going to answer that question, but I really want to know. Who do you still think about in your past? In my past? Yeah. How many boyfriends did you have? Not many. Okay, so who do you still think about? Till this current day, we've been together for about seven, Why eight, nine years. Why does it have to be boyfriends? Because it is. Who do you still, what guy do you still think about from your past? <laughs> Tell me, which one? The Asian dude? No. Which one then? Um, there was this guy that I was talking to. My family knew that I talked to him. He's actually a friend of my brother's. What's his name? Let's not disclose the names. So why do you still think about him? I don't think about him in that way. I think about him because my sister has mentioned him and my mom has mentioned him. You're taking a safe way out, bro. No. So was I'm he cute? Just... He was tall. He was tall. <laughs> Wow. So the reason why I think about him is only he simple. Was tall. No, the only simple fact is because I wonder how he's doing. Like I wonder if he ever got married and is happy. Bullshit. And you've never looked. Funny. You haven't gone to try to figure out. Anyways. Whatever. I like. He ain't got nothing on me though. Anyways, go to the next question. Of course not, baby. You got the ring. <laughs> <laughs> you got the ring, baby. Anyways, and I put the ring on that finger just so you know. What do you mean? I put the ring on your finger. I put the ring on your finger too, duh. I, I wiped you up. You what? Uh, yeah, she did. Anyways, would you rather- I'm easy, that's why. <laughs> oh, so it is. Okay, here's my question to you. Would you rather me leave you for a fling or cheat and stay? Oh man, that's good. <laughs> I like this question. It's like a- I think I, I'd rather you cheat and stay. Are you serious? Yeah, 100%. 100%. Because why would I want to be with someone that in reality, like, if you're doing a fling, you might continue doing that, right? But why would I rather, why would I want to be with someone like that, right? That did that and might continue doing that. I'd rather just know the person that I'm with and then just kind of get it over with. You cheated. You stayed and I don't have to kind of go through, you know, that revolving door that you cheated on me with this dude, you cheated on me with that dude, or you're doing your dirty stuff and I don't even know about it. Next question. This is getting hot in here. Scenario, you get a phone call or a DM from your ex. Do you tell your partner? 100%. Okay. All right. I'm just asking. Cause I feel like you get a call or a text and if you don't write back, you might just say, why would I even tell you? No? I guess if you knew the ex, if you didn't know the person and don't write so back. So then you wouldn't tell me? 
Would you want me to tell you if my ex hits me up? I know what's in your ex. Okay, so but yeah. you would want me to tell you. If an ex hits me up, hey, Francisco, what's up, baby boy? How you been? Maybe not the baby boy, but hey, Francisco, how you been? How's life? Congratulations yeah. on your wife. And you would want me to tell you that so and so hit me up? Yeah. For what? Why? Why not? But why would you want me to find out? What's like, that going to do with what? Why would you want to know if so and so hit me up? Why wouldn't I? I guess it's a girl thing. I mean, to me, re reality, if, if your ex hits you up and you don't hit them back up or anything like that, or it's just, hey, I've been good, thank you so much, he congratulated you on your life, like, I wouldn't care to know. You know what I mean? Like, I wouldn't care. Same nice hey, question. this is getting good, huh? When I take a number two, it smells like... <laughs> what the fuck? Nasty sometimes. You've never smelled my shit. The hell like I have. That. No, you haven't. Kina, we live together, girl. You go in there and you stink up the joint. You don't. You think you smell like flowers? Yeah. No. Hell no. Hell Sometimes yeah. it smells like shit. What nasty ass like? shit. Like nasty ass shit. You eat some nasty stuff sometimes. You eat the same shit I eat. And my shit smells, don't it? Stuff is disgusting. Exactly. Like <laughs> What's something about me? that you wish you would have known up front. Damn! So much, dude. So fucking much. Like what? Just so one much. thing. Don't, don't go into so, so much. So fucking much. One thing, Kina. You could be grimy as hell. I just told you. I wish I knew that. That. You could be grimy. I could be grimy? Yes. Let's not get into it. Yeah, true. let's not get into well, it. I could be grimy. <laughs> yeah, I wish I knew that. That I could be grimy? Yeah. You don't think other guys, every guy could be grimy to a certain extent? Like, you don't think relationships just, you know, have issues and... A hundred percent. One or the other it does something nice grimy? It would be nice to know it, though, up front, correct? So you thought I was just a complete angel? I, no, but, like, dig me through the dirt, grimy, that's how you are sometimes. Damn. You are. Alright, let's go to the next question. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, exactly. Damn. That's how I feel. Hey, girls, don't get no wrong idea. I don't be cheating, all right? But don't be hitting me up. Don't be hitting me up in my DM talking about, I heard you could be grimy. <laughs> Is our sex the best sex? It's the only sex I get. It's so a shit. Yeah, it's the best sex, of course. No, like the best sex. That I've ever had? Yes. Oh, yeah, most definitely. <laughs> <laughs> Why are you laughing? It is! <laughs> Why do you think you got a kid from me? <laughs> What's something that you've seen me do that you wish you could unsee? Shit, wipe your ass. Why do you do that in front of me? We're married. It's disgusting. We're married. It's disgusting. So, okay. There's so you... things, I feel like, in a, rela in a marriage, actually, because you, obviously, when you get married, I feel like most people think, or... They get married with the thought that they're going to get married forever, right? Till mm -hmm. death do them part. So there's some things that you have to, I feel, that you can't do in front of your significant other to keep that marriage, you know, blooming, you know? But why do you go inside the restroom if you don't take a dump? I don't go inside the restroom if you're taking so a dump. You, you leave the door open. So therefore, I feel like you should, I it makes our relationship like stronger, you You know? shouldn't shit in front of the sick. A significant other. That makes they shouldn't see you shit. That's just like that makes your eyes can't unsee that. They just, they just <laughs> can't. They just. And then the way you wipe your ass, you still always have shit in your like. <laughs> no, I don't. How do you? <laughs> like, that's just not appealing. It just when it comes up, what is one issue in your relationship that makes you want to leave forever? I guess when we get into that, like, some deep arguments, you know, like, when we get in that fight where it's like, man, I don't need this shit, you know what I mean? Like, that's the only thing, but I don't think there's a specific topic. I guess there might be. Okay, what's something that you're insecure about that I don't know? Right at this particular point in life, I don't think I'm insecure about it, to be honest with you. Maybe, like, when I was, like, younger, my nose, maybe. Keep my height. About your, um, weight lately, maybe that. The, yeah, like I feel like I obviously gained weight, so that's probably be the only thing right now. Cause I know I gained some weight, 
compared to I was, how I was, and I'm but trying to, wait, baby. but I'm trying to lose it, but it's hard to lose it because of the time. I don't have the time to like just focus. So but right now will probably be my way. I still love you. I know you do. That's the baby way. We both have it. I know We're you both do. We're both pregnant. <laughs> what don't you like about your partner's family? Me? Yeah. If, okay. If you saw the TikTok video, this same question came out. And I answered that they call me Jose. You remember? Yeah. It was like, what is it? And I'm like, Jose. My name is Francisco. Just so you know. Just so you know. They call me Jose. So now I'm asking the same question to you, young lady. Oh. What it don't you like about your partner's family? Sometimes I can feel, because they only speak Spanish, so a lot of times I'm kind of left out because I, I, I speak Spanish. I understand Spanish to a certain extent, but I can't really fully speak it. So a lot of times, like, a lot of them only speak Spanish. So I'm just sitting there being left out. So, so you that's wish my thing. family spoke English? Yes. So I can be included more. And I think we'll all have a better relationship if they all spoke I'll t I'll tell English. My, I'll tell my mom. <laughs> You'll tell your mom. <laughs> or I learn Spanish, I guess. Okay, let's see. You might be this. better equipped to learn Spanish than <laughs> my mom. Tell me something I do that admires, admires or inspires you. That's kind of fruity. Next question. You want me to answer that? Why not? That's such a cool question. What's something that I... Um, that I do that admires or inspire you? I really like how you're very young. A lot of people don't know, but she's just turned, what, 26? Yeah, 27, actually. She just turned 27. But when we first got together, like when she moved here, she was only 18 okay. years old. And... Um, from 18 to 26 years, 27 years old, um, she's been holding it down. She's been on her own. Her family does not live here. You know, her family lives out, you know, in a whole different state. She has nobody here. So when she came here to, you know, LA, she didn't know nobody, right? Just my friends. And she went and got her job. Um, she went and kind of figured things out. And, and um, I think that's one of the things that I admire. You, that you took that leap of faith. I like that. And you just kind of... But I thought it was going to be something about my, me being a mother. Question. Yeah, you're a good mom, but that's where it ties up. Like, you, yeah. were so, you were so young and you were so independent and you did your thing on your own. Nobody helped. Your family didn't help you. Obviously, like, I was here, so I helped you. But, you know, like, your family didn't help you. You were in a whole foreign country, basically. And you, foreign like, state. got a job. You figured it out without the help of your family. You know. Paying bills for the first time. Paying living bills. Living on your own. For the living first on your time. own. You know, you we got married and we had a kid. And, you know, you know you're raising that kid um, very beautifully. Thank you. I love that answer. Are you with me because I'm the best you could do? No. Yeah, yeah the hell you are. You are not the best I yes, could do. Yes, you are. No, you are. You can't do better than me. <laughs> Keep loving To answer your question, no, you aren't. You can't do better than me, Kina. You think you, you, think you can, but you can't. Francisco. Sakina. Are you dead serious about that answer? I am. You really think I can't do better than you? I mean, it's easier because a guy could just, you know, you, you could go get a guy, but he just wants you for that one thing. That's, so I think that's what we're talking about, looks-wise. Well, then that means I could do better than you, too. <laughs> what do you mean? Where, fam? You've never been to it with anyone better than me. Nobody. If later today you find out I have a relationship on the side, would you leave or work it out? Gone, girl. Fine. Would you really? Like, honestly, honestly, honestly. You have a relationship. What are you? It ain't like you're cheating. It ain't like you know you're just having a little thing here and there. You have a relationship with someone. Even even though we have a kid, you want to try. That's my kid. That's it. Well, you're cheating on me. You have a relationship with someone else. Hey, what? Anyways, what's up, guys? Thank you guys for watching this video, man. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Uh, make sure you guys subscribe to our channel if you haven't done so. 
Uh, we appreciate you guys. We're going to do our best to keep pumping these videos out and have, you know, longer content so you guys can kind of get to know us a little more than what you guys do in our TikToks. With that being said, you guys have a blessed day, blessed night. Uh, till I, next time. I would love to say something, actually. You want to say something? Yeah, you didn't let me say anything. This is something smooth with it. You see how it just smooth crack? with it, are you? It just crack, comes out the tongue. Say something. Thank you guys for watching. Make sure you guys like and subscribe. We appreciate every single one of you guys. Drop a comment below. Let, let us know what you guys want to see more of or just say hi. But anyways, hit those bells and subscribe. We love you guys. Viva Bye. Mexico!